Hi everyone and welcome to today's video. This is kind of like the next update um, and Bran getting neutered I guess. Bran is <laughs> just over there. Unaware. He's losing his man out tomorrow. So we're setting up a hospital cage for him. So this is a pets at home large hamster cage. Can I just say that this cage is not suitable as a full time habitat for any animal please. Do not buy this for your hamster, your mouse, you know, anything. Nothing is meant to live in here full time. This is too small. However, it makes a very good introduction cage and also a very good hospital cage. So, Bran will be going in this tomorrow when he gets home from the vets. It's very simply set up. It's small, it's got a substrate in it and it has a cube bed. It will, of course, have food and water added tomorrow, but that's it. Really, really simple. You'll spend the first night um, in there. So the next part I'm going to show you is how he's going to be at the vets. So you're going to need a carrier to take your rat to the vet in. This is my preferred one to use um, for operations and the reason being you have to take a water bottle obviously and there's this perfect hole in the top that it just sits and balances so perfectly. <laughs> so that is why this style is my preferred one. Um, I actually don't even know like what the actual, I mean that's obviously the label but I don't know the actual name of this carrier and um, like what brand or anything but it comes in a few different colours um, this is the one I prefer inside he's got his substrate, he has some bedding and he does have food I can show you there, the food is mixed in any vet who tells you you need to like starve your rat before an operation or not provide food um, for a neuter operation, run a mile from them Rats should not be fasted before an operation. They should act, have access to the food as normal. Um, same with water. And also, they should be having access to food as soon as they come round from their operation as well. Hey Bran! What's happening tomorrow mate? You have no idea. So yeah, I hope that was helpful to any of you that needed to know how to set up a hospital cage <clears throat> or what to take with you when your rat is having an operation. So tomorrow, poor Bran will be a couple of stone lighter, won't you mate? Yeah, <laughs> big stud boy. Um, so basically what I'll do is the next video that you'll see on this little kind of vlog series will be me talking about him coming home from his operation, showing you his wound, how I take care of him and basically his recovery process. So that'll be the next video. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.